Hi, everybody. Welcome to Daily Burn 365. Happy Wednesday. Nice to have you with us today. If you have been with us for a while, like so many of you have, you know that the word can't is a fiction. You know that you are capable of so much more than you ever imagined. And that is the conversation that we are having this week. It is a conversation about strength, and it's a conversation about understanding that when we push past our own expectations, we show our real strength. Just ask our community member, Carrie Veal. She's doing the challenge we've got going on. She said, oh my word, here's what I've learned doing the challenge. My body can conquer my brain. Exercise is truly addicting, and even my scalp can sweat. She says, Lisa Wheeler, I'm loving this challenge. I hope you have planned the next one. First of all, if you know Lisa Wheeler, you know she's planned the next three challenges already. She's got you guys. She's watching your back. But what Carrie has learned there is that being strong isn't about doing push-ups. It's about so much more. You guys, true strength isn't what you can do. It's overcoming what you thought you couldn't do. That is what it's all about. And this philosophy of inner strength, of achieving more than you thought you were capable of, is on full display with our guest today. We have a guest trainer in the house who is going to make you move in ways you probably never have and make you love yourself in ways you probably never have before either. Let's get to the gym. We're gonna have a great time with Patricia Moreno. Hello. Good morning. Hi, I'm so happy to be here. You have, Patricia has such a good energy about her. I wish you could be in the room with her, but I have a feeling 30 minutes from now, you will know exactly what I mean. Patricia is a mentor and a trainer and an instructor, and more than all of that, you have really walked this path from self-doubt and self-judgment to self-love, and I feel like your mission, above and beyond everything else, is to help other people make that journey, right? Yeah, and to remember, it's a process, and that if you're working your body, it's important to work your heart and your mind just as much, at least as much, and so I wanted to create a workout that could combine both, because who has the time to do it all? Right, well, we, and we talk all the time about how holistic wellness is, that if you're not working your mind and your spirit, if you're just working your body, you're never gonna get the sustainable results of just feeling good. Right, that you right. truly want. You have touched the lives of almost everybody out there, even if they don't know it yet, because you have been a teacher and a mentor to Erica Shannon, our own Erica Shannon, who talks so glowingly about you and the impact you've had on her life all the time. I love Erica. She actually was one of the, I think she actually was one of the very, very first people that I trained to teach in Tensati. I've now trained over 800 people, and she was the first group, and she actually helped me develop it. And she is just a blessing to me, and I'm sure to all of you. Well, she brings so much joy to us, and I think we have you to thank for that because the joy you put on her, she shares with us all the time, every week here. Talk to us a little bit about what we're going to do today because we're going to move, but it's not just about the movement today, right? right? It's also about the affirmations. What do you right. have in store for us? So we're going to really, what I want you to think about is you're going to learn to be your own best friend, to lift yourself up, be super kind, but while you sweat. So we're going to be speaking affirmations. I'm going to say them first. It's called a call and response, and you just repeat. But here's the thing. You're elevating your energy. So every move we do, we're going to do with an affirmation, and as best you can, just keep the smile. Bright. All right, now I grew up in one of those churches where when the minister would say something, we kind of mumbled, all right? That's not what we're doing today. We're going full-on revival in a tent, yelling out, screaming out, calling out, waking the neighbors today, right? Absolutely. All right, hold nothing back, you guys. Really let it go. Team, are you ready? Woo! I know you're ready. Patricia, it's all yours. Thank Let's you, get thank to you, it. Thank here you, thank you. Oh, go. my God. I'm so excited to be here. You guys, I'm so excited to be here with you all. Let's start just by centering. Bring your feet together. Really energize the legs. Place your hands on your hips. Lift your heart. Put a smile on your face. And just take a big, deep breath in. Nod your head yes, which is just a simple acknowledgement of yes, I'm here, and this is an act of kindness. Now I want you to place your hands on your heart. And we always start this way because it's really important to remember we're not here to fix or force, we're here to awaken love. So I want you to just say to yourself, you don't have to say it out loud, may I be happy, may I be healthy, may I feel confident today. You're just giving yourself a super sweet little wish. One more time, may I be happy, may I be healthy, may I feel good today. 
Then you bring your hands down to the side. Inhale, sweep the arms up above your head. Touch your forehead, touch the heart. Bend the knees down, pause here for a second. And you're just gonna hold in a chair pose, waking up the legs. And we're gonna gather our positive energy. So it's inhale, up. Exhale down. Inhale up and exhale down. Big breath. Inhale up and exhale down. And inhale up, but really breathe as deeply as you can all through the nose. And as you do this, you're just reminding yourself that every day, in a very true way, you are co-creating your reality. As above in your mind, so is below in your body and your life. So we wanna keep it kind. One more, inhale up. Now let's hold it down. Bring your hands to your thighs. Make sure your weight's on your heels. And you're gonna give a little bit of a pulse, activating the legs. Let's lift the toes up as well. So you're warming up through the shins. Heart forward. If you were doing yoga, it would look like a modified cobra pose. Now hold it down, place your hands on your thighs and lift the heart. Super gentle, but this is a posture of leading with love. And everything we do today, that's our number one priority, leading with love. Now release, roll up to stand. We're gonna do a crawl out, and then we're gonna hold a modified plank. Are you guys ready? Yep. Here we go. So you're gonna go crawl, two, three, four, hold, two, three, crawl back, one. Now stay in a chair pose so you're firing up your legs. Let's crawl again. One, two, strong legs, strong legs, strong core, oh yeah. And back, two, three, four, and pump. Yes. One, two, three, four, hold, 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 and back, two, three, four, pause. One more time. Hold, hold, excellent, and back. Now hold the pump, hold. Now what I want you to do here is see if you can make this a little bit bigger. And as you do this, we're gonna slow it down and do almost like a modified squat. Look, looks like this, go down and up. Now when you come up, give a little squeeze. Give a little squeeze and exhale. And when you come up, all I want you to do is say yes. So you're gonna go ha. Yes, ah, yes. yes, arms up, ah, yes, yes. ah, yes. yes, ah, yes, ah, yes, ah, yes, ah, yes. yes, two more, ah, yes, ah, yes, ah, yes. ah one more, yes. hold it up and cheer, <laughs> high five your neighbor, if you're alone, I'll be your high five for today, are you guys ready? So I'm gonna show you a move we're gonna start with first. It's called Warrior. It's like a wide second, hands come to the heart, you clap and you press the arms out. So when I say Warrior, you take this pose and you say yes, yes. Yes, yes? Yes, yes. yes. Ready pose looks like this. Very strong, ready. Are you ready? Yes, yes. 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 Warrior. Yes, yes. yes. Ready. Yes, yes. 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 Warrior. Yes, yes. Now hold it here. We're gonna do a move called on guard. It looks like a, an 11. And this is our prep for a punch. Pulse, pulse, are you ready? Yes. yes. So we're gonna practice those three moves again. Ready, pose. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Warrior. Yes, yes. 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 Ready. Yes, yes. Warrior. Yes, yes. On guard. Yes, yes. Warrior. Yes, yes. On guard. Warrior. Yes, yes. On guard. Yes, yes. Ready. Yes, yes. On guard. Yes, yes. Warrior. Yes, yes. Circle the arms. Now this is called willpower. It's a drawing up of your energy. Here's what I want you to remember. What you think about, you bring about. When your mind and body are aligned, powerful and positive, not only are you smarter, you're kinder, you wake up the intelligence in the brain. So I want you to circle. We're gonna do what's called, whoa, yes. And I want you to bring yourself up. Are you ready? Whoa. I love it.
love it. On guard. We're gonna start with a slow punch. The name of this move is called Strong. Switch sides. Straight out from the chin. Switch one more time. What's the name of this move? Strong. Strong. Hold. Let's find the beat. Go. So when you do this, what I want you to think of is you're a champion for yourself. Everything we say, we say as an aspiration, as an intention. Not like we're bragging, but like we're uplifting ourselves. And today we're focusing on progress. Progress. Today's about progress, not perfection. So as we do this, remember if you speak and work out at the same time, it's a little harder. So repeat after me, I am stronger today. I am stronger today. We are stronger today. We are stronger today. We are stronger today. We are stronger today. Strong. 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 Double time, go. Go, go. So every time you're saying I am stronger today, you're activating it. You're interrupting any negativity like, oh my gosh, I'm so tired. You just keep the positive. Arms up and cheer! Yeah. Warrior! Yes, yes! On guard! Yes, yes! Take one arm up and across. Switch sides. Up to tempo. Go. Up, up. Up, so we're doing a move, it's called faith. I want you to think of the word trust, where you trust that you can be kind to yourself. You trust that kindness brings good results. Now you're gonna do the same thing, but you're gonna take the arms down, check it out, down, across. When you cross the midline of your body, what happens is you're working both sides of the body, integrating right and left brain. When you're integrated, you have a lot more creativity, a lot more strength, a lot more power. Now we're gonna go up, up, down, down. Eight, seven, six, up, up, down, down, go. Feel your power. When you move, you're moving body and mind together. Your job is can you rewire your brain to be more kind, healthy, and positive. So today what we're talking about is I am better today. I am better today. I am better in every way. I am better every way. I feel better today. I feel better today. I feel better in every way. I feel better in every way. Now just think of progress. We're not talking about a huge shift, a tiny shift, just a tiny bit of progress today, and you're on your way. Eight, seven, six, five. Warrior! Yes, yes! On guard! Yes, yes! We're putting those two moves together, strong and faith, eight counts of each. Eight, seven, six, five. Up, up, down, down. Eight, seven, six, five. Repeat after me. I'm stronger today. I'm stronger today. I am better in every way. I'm better in every way. We are stronger today. We are stronger today. And we are better in every way. We are better in every way. On guard. Yes, yes, yes. Uppercut slow. So the name of this move is called Inspired. Inspired. When I say go, you're gonna take it up one notch. Ready? Yes. Go. Up. Now think of the word inspired. When you're inspired, you become a better person by far than you've ever imagined yourself to be. But it's up to you to keep your mind on what's right. Are you ready? Yes, yes! Let's double time. Go, 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 go. Think of inspiring yourself. Think of going beyond where you've gone before, but from a place of kindness, an audacious stepping up of your amazingness. Eight, seven, six, five, one, four, three, two, cheer! Yes! I totally got you. I got you, we got you, hang with me. You're doing great, I can feel it. Bring your feet together, bring your hands on your heart. Take your arms up, this is like a wide yes. Like you're saying yes to health, you're saying yes to good. Hands at the heart and bow. Bring your hands back to your heart, it's called abundance. So it's up, down, up, down, up. Down, use your legs, up. Make sure you sit back on those heels, up, down, up, 
down, up. Now here's the deal. When the arms go up, I want you to think of doing like a ta-da. Here I am, four and three and two. Check this out. You go, oh yes, oh yes, oh yes, oh yes, oh yes, oh yes, woo! It's a pose, like here I am, take me as I am, oh yeah. Stop and cheer! Yeah. We're gonna put the last two moves together. Yeah, yeah. The uppercuts and abundance. Are you ready? Yes, yes! On guard! Four, three, two, go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three feet together, up and down. Feet apart, uppercuts. Eight, seven, you can double time this one, go, or you can single time it. I am inspired to be. Inspired to be. The very best that I can be. Best that Woo! I can be. We are inspired to be. We are inspired to be. The very best that we can be. Best that we Warrior. can be. Warrior. Yes, on, yes. On guard. Yes, yes. Nod your head yes. We're gonna do all four moves together. Yeah. No affirmations on this round. Just get it in your body. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, punch. <laughs> up, up, down, down. The name of this move is called Faith. Uppercuts, here you go, uppercuts. Single or double time, up to you. Feet together, arms up in a V, and down in a V. Let's do that again. I am stronger today. I am stronger today. I am better in every way. I am better in every way. I am inspired to be. I am inspired to be. The very best that I can be. The very best that I can be. One more, stronger today. I am stronger today. I am better in every way. I am better in every Woo! way. Inspired to be. I am inspired to be. The very best that I can be. The best that I can Cheers. be. Cheers! Yes! Boom. Boom. Jamie just had a baby, yes. and she's back at it. Yeah! Woo! Take a sip of water if you need to take a sip of water, and try to remember, we're bringing up the positive energy. Feet together. This is called block two. You're gonna take your hands above your head. Now bring them in front of you. So clapping is a sign of celebration behind you. In front of you. The name of this move is appreciation. Two counts. Two, 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 two. You can march it out. Appreciating your body. One more time. Now we're gonna do double, sorry, singles. Go. Single, 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 single. Two. Now we're gonna do what's called hallelujah feet. Here's where we're going to church. Boom, drop, boom, drop. One arm out, like you're inviting something in. Switch sides, like you're inviting something in. Up to tempo. So the name of this move is called Invite. If you want more good into your life, to come into your life, you've gotta put yourself in a positive state and become a magnet for good. Health, wealth, joy, and success come from positive states. So as you pull it in, I want you to imagine you're inviting Health, wealth, joy. Say it with me. Health, health wealth, wealth, joy, joy. success. Health, wealth, wealth joy. joy. Put a smile. Health, health wealth, wealth, joy. Don't you want success. more? Health, health wealth, wealth, pull it in. Joy, Say success. yes again. Health, yes. Wealth, wealth, joy, joy. success. I invite good in. I invite good in. I invite good in. I invite good in. Eight, seven, six from appreciation, and go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, invite. Eight, seven, six, five, four, clap, appreciate. My body is my temple. My body is my temple. I am the keeper of my health. I'm the keeper of One my health. One more, my body is my temple. My body is my temple. I am the keeper of my health. I'm the keeper of my health. Warrior. Yes, yes. Ready. Yes, yes. Love and action. So you're gonna do tap, skips, tap, drop. If you get tired and you wanna come back to this, that's absolutely fine. But everything we do, we do from a state of love. Check out my feet. We're gonna step out, we go 
hug, step out, hug, other side. This is the super simple version. Now we want to make it more of a hug, hugging, drop. Actually touch your body. Your body actually thrives when you touch it in a loving, loving way. Now we're gonna make it a little bit bigger. Boom, drop, boom, drop, boom. Yes, love in action. I am love in action, baby. Love in action. I am love in action. I love in action. One more, love in action. I love in action. Cheer! <laughs> Take your arms up. And I want you to think of a time when you felt so excited about your life. Maybe some success you had. I want you to invigorate yourself from that place. And you pump your arms up. And think about all your good fortune. Think about what's going right in your life. Think about what's great. And when I say go, I want you to cheer for like five seconds straight, like it was the best day of your entire life. Are you ready? Ready! Are you ready? Yes, yes. Cheer! Yes. Together. Keep invigorating yourself. Appreciation for your body. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Invite. Love and action. Step your feet together first. Step out. Now, victory, cheer. And here we go. My body is my temple. My body is my temple. I am the keeper of my health. I'm the keeper of my health. I am love in action. I am love in action. All is well. And all One is well. One more time. Well. My body is my temple. My body is my temple. I am the keeper of my health. I am the keeper of my health. I am love in action. I am love in action. All is well. And all is well. Inhale, sweep the arms up. Feet together, we're going into our final block. A little core, a little lower body. Oh. Say courage, confidence, gratitude, oh. strength. Courage, courage, confidence, courage. gratitude, strength. Courage, courage confidence, confidence, gratitude, strength. strength. One more. Courage, courage confidence, confidence, gratitude, strength. Ready, pose. Arms right out in front. It takes courage to be kind. Step your leg back. Pull like a bow and arrow. Thumb is up like you're aiming at something. Really fix your attention. Now you're gonna do a split lunge. Inside arm goes up. This is confidence. Now you're gonna bow, hands on the thighs. Step your feet together, give me a muscle pose. This is the pose of strength. Let's do it. Four, three, two, one, four, three, two, one, four, three, two, one, four. Courage, confidence. Gratitude, strength, courage. You're calling it up. You're bringing it up. You're remembering it's important. A little faster. Confidence, gratitude, strength, courage. Confidence, gratitude, strength, courage. Confidence, gratitude, strength. One more. Courage, confidence, gratitude. And stop. Shake it out. Other side, feel your legs, feel the power in your legs. Give me a nice, strong courage. Opening up the heart. Split lunge. Sometimes being nice to yourself is a really courageous act. Bow, gratitude, focus on what's good, focus on what's right. Step your feet together, power pose. Wake up your greatness. We're gonna do it all on four counts. Ready? Yeah. Let's do it. Four, three, two, one, four, three, two, one, bow. Demonstrate your strength. This is how we call it up. This is how we interrupt that negativity and rewire and inspire. Our brain literally changes when we change how we speak to ourselves. Let's speed that up. One, two, one, two, one. When you do something new, something new can show up in your life. So we want to remember how we speak to ourselves creates our world. Our word creates our world. One more time. And hold. Stay in muscle pose. Put the lips up. I know. You don't have to feel like it to do it. Pull it up. Pull it up. Ready pose. 
Now, are you up for a little bit of a challenge? Are you guys yes, up for yes, a little bit yes, of a challenge? Yes, yes, yes. Yes, We're gonna, yes, yes. We're gonna do alternating sides. We'll do it slowly first. Stand in ready pose. Put the smile on your face. Four, three, two, here we go. Four, three, two, one, four, three, two, one, four, three, two, one, switch. You hit each pose to embody that feeling, that state of mind. Imagine how different your life can be when you just feel a little more confident, even just a little bit. Courage, confidence, gratitude, strength, courage, confidence, gratitude, strength. One more time. Courage. Confidence. Confidence. We're gonna try speeding gratitude. it up. Yes, Let's yes. get a little faster. Woo -woo! Courage. Confidence. Confidence. Gratitude. Strength. Courage. Confidence. Gratitude. Strength. Courage. Confidence. Gratitude. Strength. One more. Courage. Confidence. Gratitude. And hold. Strength. Stay there. Nod your head. Yes. Yes. If you ever get stuck in stress, you can simply do this. It's all right. No big deal. No big deal, it's all good. Oof. Ready, pose. I wanna do one set of warrior push-ups. I wanna do one set of warrior push-ups. Now, you probably don't know what a warrior push-up is, and I'm gonna give you a modification. But it's super simple. We're gonna start with our feet apart. You're gonna place your hands down while you squat. You'll jump back to a loaded beast. You'll jump forward to a wide, and you'll just bring your hands up. If you wanna give it an option, Barbara's gonna show you the option. Four, three, hands on the floor. Go, down, back, front, yes. Down, back, front, yes. Oops. When you come up, say yes. 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 Down, back, front, yes. Down, back, front, yes. Down, back, let's do two more. Yes. Down, back, front, yes. One more. Hold, yes. hold, do you feel it? Stay in your legs, stay in your legs. When you say yes, your whole body relaxes and you're not fighting against what you're trying to get. You're bringing it in. Feet together, ready, pose. Shake it out. Super challenge, are you up for a super challenge? Yes, yes! You're gonna go courage, confidence, gratitude, strength. Courage, confidence, gratitude, strength. And one warrior push up. Yes? Yes, yes. Ready, go. Courage, confidence, oh. gratitude, strength. strength. Courage, confidence, strength. And hold, yes. feet together. Again, say it with me. Courage, confidence, gratitude, strength. Courage, confidence, gratitude. Drop. Feet together. Want to do it again? Yes! Woo! Courage, confidence, We're gonna do one more. But I wanna really hear you. Let's go! Courage, confidence, gratitude, strength. Courage, confidence, gratitude, strength. Chair. Stay low, tap. Do you feel it? Yes. Just go like this. Rub your legs, go thank you legs. Thank you knees. Thank you. Now stand up a little taller. Be like, thank you, arms. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Shake it out a little bit. How do you guys feel? So good. You can start to just shake it off a little bit. I want you to start feet together, hands on your heart, as we bring it all the way down. Just breathe for a second. Don't close your eyes if your heart rate is too high. Just look straight ahead. But take a moment. Sati means awareness. Notice how you feel. Good feelings bring good results. And sometimes we focus on the results to give us the good feelings. But you gotta exercise your power to bring it all the way in and down. So we're cooling it down. We're gonna end the way we started. Breathe in, in. Pause, touch your forehead, touch your heart, extend the arms to the floor. 
Inhale like you're gathering more good than you've ever had before. Forehead, heart. So what you're doing here is you're aligning thoughts, words, and actions. You're waking yourself up off of autopilot. Sometimes we don't even realize how hard we are on ourselves. But you gotta remember you can never get happy from being harsh. You can never find abundance when you're focusing on what you don't have. It's a state of mind. Health is a state of mind and body. Last time, inhale. Super important. Stand with your hands at the waist. Superhero pose, his feet apart. I want you to look forward, heart open. Nod your head yes. And I want you to do this at least one time in the mirror today. It's called audacious self-acceptance, where you just look in the mirror and audaciously, you say, I accept myself and my life exactly as I am. Keep the smile. Take one arm up, stretch to the side, opening up the sides of the body, letting more light in. Imagine filling your whole body with light, 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 light. Switch sides. Think about how good you've got it. Of course, we all have a long list of things that we want to improve, or maybe we have injuries or health and things, but contemplate your good fortune. One more time, inhale. Think of one thing you can think of right now where you're like, you know what? I got it kind of good. Switch, and as you do that, you think a pure positive thought for 68 seconds, that will start a compound effect. Step your feet together. Inhale, sweep the arms up. We're gonna do a little bit of a modified back bend, hands on the thighs. Round your spine, tuck your tailbone, release your head. And just think of light going in between every one of your vertebrae, healing it, restoring it, and renewing it. And you can just mentally affirm, my body is now restoring itself to a state of perfect health. Now arch, send the heart forward. It's almost like a baby cobra if you were on the floor. Heart forward. My body now restores itself to a state of perfect health. Drop your head. Inhale, sweep the arms up one more time. We're gonna end with the hands in gratitude. And I just want you to say, mentally, send a wish of kindness. May I be happy. May I be healthy. May I have strength. Now think of your loved ones. May they be happy. May they be healthy. May they find their strength. Now think of everybody you know. Send this blessing all the way out. May they be happy. May they be healthy. May they find their strength. Breathe in. And just mentally affirm, thank you for my life. Thank you for my life. Thank you for my life. It's with gratitude I live my life. Thank you for my life. Thank you for my life. Today, I choose to be kind. May all beings everywhere be happy, healthy, and free, and may we remember that it begins right here with you and me. Have a great day, everybody. Great job. Great job. Well done. Congrats. Woo! Congrats. Wow! Wow! <laughs> Workout. That was so good. First of all, I just, I'm, I'm kind of a hugger, so I need a hug, because you made me all emotional there. That was so good. Um, a lot of people out in the community in live chat are talking about being emotional, some people being in tears. There is something I think extremely liberating about what you do and what you did, which was sort of giving us permission to be joyful and to be loud and to say kind things about ourselves. Why do you think we find so, why do we find, I'm all touchy all of a sudden. No, I'm like, I love oh, it, I love like, it. Like, hi, Patricia. Um, why do you think we struggle so much giving ourselves permission to be kind to ourselves and to be joyful like that. Because we think it's a sign of weakness. If I don't push myself, I'm not gonna go to the gym. If I don't berate myself, how am I gonna ever get myself to make those changes? But we don't realize that it's that force and that push that drains our energy. And kindness is not weakness, it's courageous. Yeah. So if you say, what's the kindest thing I could do today? Oh, it's to eat well. Yeah. It's to go to the gym, that's the kind thing. It'll guide you in a very different way. It is a, it is a tricky, tricky balance, I think, for so many of us to say what you asked us to say, to look in the mirror and say, I accept myself and my life exactly as I am. To say that 
uh, but then to also want to work on ourselves. Like, like to say, I am so perfect important. and I can be better. And to hold both of those thoughts, to want to be better doesn't mean you don't love who you are but now. But here's how it goes. If I look at myself and I say, oh my gosh, I need to lose some weight. Look at this, I feel awful, horrible. We're in a place of lack. And you can never get health from a place of hate. So you say, look, this is my body. I'm healthy, I love this body. Okay, I'd really like to drop a few pounds. Got a wedding coming up. What would be the kindest way to do that? But you've gotta do it with kindness because if your heart closes, then it's just punishment. But if your heart is open, that's, you know, if you watch the royal wedding, what did yeah. you talk? Love is the power, love is the power. And we've gotta be courageous enough to choose love. I totally, I totally agree. Some great feedback from from live chat. Deanna said, this is everything that I didn't know that I needed today. That's awesome. Right? <laughs> Stacy Wright says, I absolutely love her. I need her to come narrate my whole day for me, right? Right, I love that. Shabella said, that was amazing. Starry Love said, that was the best way to start my day. So good. Um, I, think, I think that something everybody out there should know about you, because I think it will relate to everybody, is that you, you had your own personal struggles growing up. You had a really hard time with body image. You had oh a God. really hard struggle with weight. And, and instead of leading it to self-loathing, it led you somehow, miraculously, to self-love. Well, it was, a, it, was a, it was a really tough journey because I was on my first diet at eight years old. And then by the time I was 12, I was 212 pounds. Then I found exercise and I was like, hallelujah. But then I went too far. And then I started over-exercising. Then I was bulimic. And then I was using drugs. My mantra was thin at any cost. But I was never working on my mind. So even though my body evolved, my heart didn't. So I wanted to, what I do call break the spell of unworthiness. And I realized that heart had, and love and kindness had to be part of the puzzle. So why not train them together as a whole being? Yeah. Not think of your body as an ornament, but as an instrument, something to have you live your life in a way that you're kind and gentle with yourself. What's the, what is the one, thing, since we don't get the pleasure of having you every single day, what is the one thing you want people to take away, to hold on to from this 30 minutes they got to spend with you? One thing that you can do to decide if this is the right thing for you, just have your mantra be, is this the kindest thing I could do for me? And that's not gonna lead you to sitting on the couch and eating chips all the time. It might be, I need a kick in the butt and get myself out there. But just, is this kind? Is this kind? Am I talking to my children in a kind way? Am I talking to my loved ones? And that doesn't always mean soft. Sometimes it means boundaries. Sometimes it means a firm no. But if you let that be your inner mantra, you will always find what's in alignment with your heart and your soul. I love it. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you, you again. So much. Such a good workout. Thank you. Um, you know, you, you mentioned wanting uh, Patricia to come and narrate your day. She kind of can do that because all of the mantras that we did today, all of those affirmations, Patricia has put together in a document that you can get at her website. If you go to patriciamoreno.com slash daily burn, you can download all of those mantras. You don't need to be here in class to tell yourself you're great, you're grateful, you're competent, you're strong. You are all of those things 24 hours a day. So if you want a little reminder of how awesome you are, go get that PDF, go get those mantras, and use them day in and day out. What we said, what we did here today is a reminder of what we're talking about all week. True strength isn't about the push-ups, it's not about the burpees, it's not about the weight, it's overcoming, it's pushing through, it's being kinder and the best version of you mm. that you can possibly be. We love you guys, thank you for being here, thank you Patricia, thank you class. We'll see you tomorrow everybody, have a great day.